Everybody ready? Take the first dip. All right, let's go. Two, three. What a great day for the students of Youngstown City School District. It's been a long time coming. I know the kids really appreciate it. I appreciate everything you've done. When Eddie took on this responsibility, I want to thank Wendy Webb. I've known for years for coming up with this idea because not only did you end up building a stadium, but you cleaned up a neighborhood here. Yeah. And, and that's yeah. something that I've been pushing ever since I got involved in City Think about when you're in high school and how impressionable you are. You know, there's certain things that you remember and that you can never forget. And these kids, when they run through this tunnel today, they're never gonna forget that. And it's because of all of you, and I'm just glad to be a part of it. Thank you so much. There's a lot of famous athletes played on this field, and I'm so happy that it's here for them to use. My advice is just to stay strong, always be involved. Sports are very, very important. They'll keep you healthy, strong, and they'll keep you focused on what you need to do in school. And take care of you when you get away to college and older to give back to the community. You know that the community is all coming together and the saying that they're using is one city, one team and to see everybody out here supporting uh, the East Panthers which is kind of like a new version of Youngstown. It, you see all the banners and everybody coming together, it's just super exciting. The students that will be using our new Ramfield and I say ours because I've traveled many, many years out of the city to other fields that we had to pay uh, to have our home games. Just enjoy this field but most of all respect it because by the community bringing this together for you, it shows the respect and the love we have for you. So you need to respect it and take care of it. Support your school. Do the best you can. It can only help you. You know, just school spirit means a lot, and we're glad we have the stadium for them. And I think it'll help everybody in Youngstown, not just the students. I think it'll help everything. Well, you know, it's so exciting because to have a place where everyone from all sides of town can come together as one community and support one team and our students, whenever we can do anything to uplift our students and bring the community together, I just think it's awesome. This new stadium bring everybody back to the school district so the kids will have a good fan base. They haven't had that for years. It means so much for them to have a home crowd, you know, playing away every Friday night. It can't feel that good. I would hate to do that. When I was playing football, if I would have done that, I don't know how that would have felt. This is, this is great. It's great. This is an asset to the community. This is something that the community has been waiting on since 1993 when we lost the Rand Stadium. Uh, deterioration, it was just deteriorating. So we got the idea to say, with the superintendent way up and now Dr. Hawthorne and Board of Education said, let's rebuild that stadium, let's let our students have their own stadium. And I think this is the finished product. So I'm, I'm, I'm enthused, I'm, I'm very happy on this, very happy. It's not just about football, it's, it's, it's about life. I would say all athletes in turn really have a jump on those who are non-athletes to a point because you're basically tested from being a, a man or a woman a little earlier than someone else who basically didn't participate in it. That's the advantage of basically all dealing with sports. So hopefully in turn that they can take something away from it whether well, everyone's a winner today because it's history. And I hope they take it and run from it. And remember one thing, win or loss, the sun will come up tomorrow.